So Laura, what are you what are you doing? Uh, currently, um, we're actually trying to make um, some capacitors, but a different like we're, from, we're trying different variations on um, how we like the structure. So using two conductor plates and then um, we're at the moment we've got some salt water solution in between. Um, what we're going to do at the moment is charge them up for an hour. <laughs> Charge up the capacitors. Yeah, 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 for an hour and then uh, integrate it into the circuit. And also alongside we've got um, some photo cells which have been made from oxidized copper. Some what cells? Uh, photo cells. Okay. Uh, and we've got some whiskers as well. So we were trying out this yesterday and this, this works quite nicely um, into this circuit which um, is based on a design by um, my friend Aidan and then I've like took parts of it and adapted it to how, yeah, I guess to my own needs. So this is going through here. Mm -hmm. And then... Can I just ask, Rachel, you, like, there's a lot of stirring going on. Oh, sorry. What's all the stirring about? Oh, it's trying to dissolve the salt in the water, or there's also baking soda that we're trying to dissolve, or then it's going to dissolve. Yeah. So this is one of your capacitors here? Yeah, this is like two of them at the moment. Okay. I mean, we've kind of trialled and arrowed, arrowed our way through them all. Um, and then we did a bit more research last night, so we've kind of taken a different approach, different angle now. And um, how come it's important to stir so much? Uh, just to make sure the solution is completely dissolved. Okay, because there was like a so lot of stirring going on. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so there's like everything's dissolved and you've got like a nice solid salt water solution rather than... Uh, yeah, the sediment on the bottom. Okay, and Rachel, what, what's you're just patching that cap capacitor into the board there? Yeah, I mean, right now we're just going to plug it up into a, to a battery and try to charge it up. That was the thing yesterday. We were playing around and stirring a lot, but like actually a lot of things we weren't doing properly. Like you know, you should have warm water so it dissolves easier, and like the the copper. I mean, the materials just weren't. Um, you have to sand it in order to make it like more... Sand what? Sand the copper or sand the aluminum. The aluminum foil? Yeah, so okay. to make it easier to oxidize in the water or something in the solution. So okay, we, interesting. we're doing a lot of things. Okay. Right, so now we're trying to do it right. Which is like, well. well, yeah, I guess an important part of it is just trying to make it... Basically prepping trash. <laughs> yeah. And uh, Eva, what are you doing here? Oh, okay. Well, I'm, uh, I'm working with different uh, chips. And I just kind of randomly joined them together. Oh, well, it's not really based on any schematic, so I'm just looking how it's gonna. You're just listen. You're just plugging away and listening. Yeah. And so, okay. And so the timer gives everything off this crazy noise which is happening right now. Mm -hmm. Plus, well, I have some lines, you know, which act like temperature sensors and actual temperature sensors. I'm gonna connect this stuff that I. Rotting mushrooms. So rotting <laughs> mushrooms are going to control <laughs> yeah. the resistance. frequency or the resist. Okay, so it's going to be resistance. Okay. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, just joining uh, circuits together to see how it reacts. Changing, checking relation. So. So I can connect. Okay, so the light is going to be altered along with the sound. Okay, and um, how are you? What's the what's going to be used to change the temperature? Oh yeah, here. Here's the one. Yeah, but I mean, what are you putting in? Oh yeah, I'm just gonna have a. I'm gonna have yeah, a, yeah, this is it. This is not cool. Okay, yeah. so like you need a torch. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And this guy. Yeah. So, and yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I'm keep. Feeling around and see what's, what's going to Okay. Yeah. What's, can I ask just in general, is, has anything that you've been experimenting with been like, oh shit, that's cool? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually, there was a moment where we um, just decided to play um, rather than, you know, kind of follow some structure or some kind of design. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and then there was a point where. Uh, I'm not even. This is. I think this is the part of it though. I'm not even sure what happened. <laughs> mm -hmm. But um, it was when we had everything kind of connected up together, and uh, yeah, this circuit was just doing things that I've not even heard it do before. Cool. Um, once those things that we've been building kind of put into it, and 
also it was picking up some of the uh, electromagnetic field as well, which is not done. So I'm not sure if this is part of what I've been building that's helping it do that, which, yeah, it sounded quite nice and mm. slightly... You should have been to do that in performance, like just use your computer for electromagnetic field. Yeah, it's not the music. Mm. <laughs> cool. And how is the radio being integrated here? Oh, we were not sure how we're going to do that. Am I, I, do you want to use the radio? Or not? Um, yeah, that hasn't been integrated at all yet. Okay, <laughs> okay cool. Yeah. Anything else you feel like is important to say here? We love electronic! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs>